on YouTube. Look at all these gardeners. Look at all these gardeners. Wow. Hooray for you all. Getting your hands in the dirt. Yeah, we did yeah. too, didn't we kids? So here's Mrs. Roberts. This is Mrs. Roberts' seventh grade class. Hi, I'm uh, Molly Roberts, and uh, we're in Phoenix, Arizona, where the sun shines all the time. Right, kids? Yes. And today we had a lovely rainstorm to help our garden. We have 132 uh, seventh and eighth graders, and we have planted a spring garden. We hope to uh, harvest around May, and we're going to have enough vegetables and fruit to have salsa, to make a big salad, have broccoli and cheese, strawberries and ice cream, what else kids, lettuce, cilantro, and we have been doing this for about 10 years. We usually have two gardens a year, one in the fall and one in the spring. And all of the children log, hold up your logs kids so they can see, so we log every day and we check out whether we're growing, not growing, compare sun, our sunny garden to our shady garden. And that's about uh, what we do. We uh, stick with the state standards for inquiry and we observe and we write and we speak and write English and we're just a great bunch, aren't we? Yeah. So is this the sun garden or the shade garden? The no. shade. Shade garden. So, what plants do you grow? Would someone like to give us a tour of the shade garden? Okay, and tell us what plants you're growing. Okay, this is Jasmine. Say who you are when you. Hi, I'm Jasmine, and I'm at Lowell Elementary School. Okay, give okay us you're going to show us the, the, the cert plants you're learning have different requirements in terms of light, right? This is the broccoli, and then it's been growing like a, a couple inches. Um, when did you plant the broccoli? About we planted two weeks ago. Two weeks In ago? two weeks, you have that much of a plant? Well, we, we're doing pretty good. Wow, what did you do to make your soil so healthy? Um, water. Water, <laughs> water, water. Did yeah. you put any compost on? We put uh, compost from Walmart. Walmart gave us compost and fertilizer, and we put that in last year, and we've been letting it sit. To, that's great. No wonder together. that's the healthiest broccoli in two weeks I ever saw. <laughs> what else you have here? There's Roman tomatoes over here. Oh wow. And uh, you've seen it's been growing too from the two weeks. And this is cabbage. Do you like cabbage? Yeah. Yeah? I like it in my soups. Okay. There's strawberries over here. Ice cream or a milkshake or something? Great. <laughs> and it's been growing like a bomb. <laughs> onions. Wow, what a variety. We've been getting more stems for the onions to grow. Oh, okay. <coughs> bell peppers. As you can see, it's really small. But it'll grow. How small, Jasmine? <coughs> How small did you say the seeds are? Well, yeah, they that big, huh? uh, I'll say it's about an uh, inch or two long. This is great. I'm wondering if someone else can volunteer to say, thank you so much, Jasmine, to tell us what you've been learning through the gardening. Yes. Well, What's your name? Anthony. Um, Anthony, I mean. Well, we've been learning about plant life and what it takes to kale and ultra for a plant and how to make sure it doesn't get too much sunlight or too much water or too much soil or too much compost or anything. We have to make sure it gets the right amount and we have to make sure it's doing healthy and fine because we take daily observations with the plant to make sure it's healthy. And we always have to make sure that nothing bad happens to the plant, <coughs> like like people don't come and step on it. Oh, yeah. Because that would be really bad. And we're learning that 
plant life is a lot like animal life and human life because it needs swallow and nutrient and kale to keep it for a healthy lifespan. Excellent. Any other comments or additions to oh, that? And it needs to survive and reproduce. Okay, so how do how do the plants uh, reproduce anyway? Oh. Yes. Well, they reproduce by their seeds. By, by what? The seeds. Oh, by the seeds. Okay, so did you start all these plants from seeds? No, Miss Roberts bought them and we planted them. Okay, so they already were little seedlings. Okay. Yes? Um, this, this side, it grows. Their plants grow faster because there's more sun. Do you want to give us a little tour of that? Yeah. Yes. That's the sun garden? Yes. What's your name? DeAndre. This is um, broccoli. And so you have broccoli both in the shade garden and the sun garden? Yeah. And then this is. Oh, this lettuce. is lettuce. And this is. That looks like lettuce too. Yeah. It looks like you have quite a few varieties of lettuces here. And I think this is purple lettuce. Yeah. Then this is strawberry. There's green bell back there. <laughs> and this one. This one's bigger broccoli. And more lettuce. Here's onion, it looks like. Chives. It's green. Onion, and then there's more onion back here. There's bell pepper, I think. Chili pepper. That's chili oh, pepper. Oh wow, that's gonna be hot. Then here's some serrano pepper, and this is tomato. Thank you so much for the tour.